Hey everyone, it's me, Xcanadensis, and today I have a very exciting thing in this box that, um, really didn't expect to get, especially not now, but it came up on eBay for super cheap. I just so happened to be checking the ending soonest tab, and I saw this item ending for, I think, $50 plus 10 shipping, and I was like, I guess I'll bid. And I did, and I won it, and I was like, okay. <laughs> like, I wasn't... I wasn't unbelievably, like, searching for this or anything. I just happened upon it and went for it, and then I got it. So, um, I was a little bit surprised that she came so fast. They shipped her two-day priority. Uh, so, yeah, let's get into it. I'm always gonna act like it's a mystery, even though y'all know, because it's in the thumbnail and the title. <laughs> Alright, so we've got a Domino's pizza bag and a Walmart bag. I paid uh, 60 bucks for these guys. <laughs> I'm kidding. Okay, so here she is. I got a Comic-Con Blue Believe Explode. Now I know. I'm gonna hear. Brooke, you already have that Sorry, my kitten's playing with the box. You already have that one! Yes. But, I bought this one, who has a damaged box. Because I'm gonna be a monster. Rip her open. For all to see. So, um, because I'm so in love with my Silver Believe Explode, who I have out of the box, and I bought her out of the box, um, I've been on the hunt for the other two out of the box. Gold and Blue. And maybe even Comic-Con Daphne and... Uh, blue harmonics bloom uh, And actually a blue believe X bloom has been up on eBay for some time out of the box the seller is charging $90 so I messaged the seller saying hey It's fine if this is the price you're looking for but just so you know I will offer you $50 because these things sell in the box with the COA and everything for $90 and that's what you're selling her for and she was like now nah, I can get more for That one's still listed to this day, and I just got this one for 60 in the box so just saying. <laughs> anyway, alright. I have never opened one of these, so... Let's see. Here's some tape. I don't know why I'm trying to keep the box good. It's already screwed up, and I have one in the box. Okay. This is weird. Alright. Oh my god, she's really cool. I have never actually looked at her outfit like this. It looks so cool in person. Wow. Okay. So for starters, mine didn't have this. Because uh, she was uh, she was missing her brush and her COA. This is the little COA. And it just has a sketch of Silver Believe Explum, or like a drawing. Um, I've never seen that art before. I think that's pretty cool. I'm shocked nobody's made a vector of that. Um, and then we have a, this is the COA. It says Blue, Blue Believix exclusively for 2012 Comic Con International San Diego. Jack Specific Inc. blah 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 blah. 2012. And then it says Limited Edition and it just says 511 right there. So yeah, this one's also not a great number, which is another reason why I was like, I don't really care about um, keeping her in box. I mean, maybe that number is significant to people, but um, I like certain odd numbers that end in threes and even numbers. So this number was like, oh, and five, obviously. Five's a good number. Alrighty. Here is her brush, which is so cool. It's going to go in the bucket of brushes. <laughs> um, and then there's this interesting little brochure right here. I'm not sure what it is. Oh, it says, coming fall 2012. Oh, I have that DVD. It is right there. <laughs> and it says, the Believix Collection, Concert Collection, the Mini Believix Collection, Fruity Music Bar Playset for the Minis, Magic Wings Bloom, Rock Concert Stage, Rockstar Guitar, Microphone, and the Dance in Glow Groove Mat. Pretty cute. There's a piece of history there. <laughs> um, I think I want to put that up where all my Season 4 dolls are, because that's kind of cool. Um, and now to start... Cutting her out of here. Ah! Should I pose for the thumbnail while she's like still in? <laughs> I'm too lazy to like stop the video and like edit it. I just want her out now and I want to upload this now. I actually have two very exciting packages, so I want to get this done. <laughs> Alrighty, so let's get Blue Believe Explume out. Gosh, she's really cool in person. Like, Wow. I've seen pictures of her online and I thought cute, but I wasn't like this impressed, but now just having her not even all the way out, just seeing her here is like crazy. She's really, really pretty. Alright, I've got that. She's really in here because she's not meant to come out. But sister, before anybody comments like, oh my gosh, someone else could have had that one in box, blah, blah, blah. People like to have them in box, Ew, you're wasting it. Toys are meant to be played with. I like how I slurred my words on that one. It's something I say all the time. Toys are meant made to be played with, and what somebody does with their things, regardless of if it's a toy or like a 
journal or something. People spend their money, they get to do whatever they want with the product. If you wanted it, you could have spent your money on it. And that is how that is. Alright. I'm just I'm I'm foreseeing the comments. Alrighty, here she is. I'm shocked the Comic Con dolls have box hair. <laughs> If you don't know what that is, that's a doll collecting term when the hair looks like a mess straight away out of the box. Alright, she's got blue tinsel. It is super, super nice and pretty. I love the the blue in the hair contrasting with the red. I think it's really pretty. Um, and then she's also got her little yellow braid in the back with the blue tinsel coming out. It's so funny because I know this outfit fully because I made it for myself. The silver version, but it's the same thing. Oh gosh, this is so gorgeous. I kind of want to make this outfit for myself now, but after the struggle that I've had with Silver Blue Explume, I don't want to ever do this again. <laughs> um, so pretty. I'm just kidding. I'm probably going to. I really want to do normal Blue Explume. All right, so she's got plastic around her tibias. What part of the foreleg? Calves. <laughs> Uh, she's got plastic around the calves because uh, black fabric, or black netting especially, I've noticed can uh, stain dolls really well, so they've just taken that precaution, but they haven't stained them yet. Uh, very, very pretty. Got the blue shoes, which I really think contrasts with the black socks really well. Um, this skirt is really cool. Um, it's interesting because you can see the details of this outfit much better on this doll because each color is like, or each piece is like an alternating really uh, powerful color. No, ma'am! She wants to get on here. <laughs> uh, she's just so gorgeous. Alright, let's get those wings out. That is arguably the best part. These dolls are so cool. Alright. I'm really scared to scratch the wings. Because uh, you don't notice how scratched your doll's wings are until you start taking pictures of them with flash. And you're like, wow, it actually looks like this is a... Like, I scraped it on cement. That's what I'm gonna go with. I was gonna do a very specific reference that only really fits my life, and it wouldn't really make sense. I was gonna say the back of the iPod Touch I had when I was in fifth grade, but, like, <laughs> doesn't really relate to anybody. Alright, her wings are really interesting. So we have the blue to match everything and the blue rhinestones. Uh, the blue outline of the normal Believix bloom shape of the wings. And then she, it actually has silver glitter, on it, or not silver glitter, the holographic detailing on the outsides of that. Which is the same on Silver Believe Explode, but I would have expected them to keep it inside the lines. But I actually really like this look. I think that it makes them look super dynamic and cool. And my goodness, these wings shine. And there's the back. Alright, let me put them on her so we can see her all done and put together. This is the perfect doll to get for Halloween, I just realized. Short of getting another Halloween doll, which would have been really cool. Um, she's very, like, gothic looking because of the blue and black color scheme. I don't know. Looks like a gothic believix to me. Maybe that's just me. Alrighty. So here she is with her wings on. She looks so cool. Wow. See, I wonder- I think Silver's probably still my favorite just because she's been there. But uh, I can't even imagine if I had this doll out of box first. Would she have been my all-time favorite? Screw the other ones, you know? Um, she's really, really cool. We'll see if she beats Silver Believe Explume and gets her own funny episode of my weird series that I've never continued. I don't know what I'm talking about. She's really, really pretty. I really like her. So here's the turnaround. Alrighty, guys. Thank you guys so, so much for watching, and let me know. Hold on. Just in case you haven't seen Silver Loot Explume yet. I don't know how you wouldn't have. Where is she? Do we prefer Silver or Blue Believe Explume? Oh my gosh, it's so weird to have them both in my hands like this. Um, Silver's still my favorite. Sorry. I love them both. They're so cute. Uh, it's really weird that I now have two of blue and two of silver and zero of gold. <laughs> but like, wow. Someday I hope to get at least one of gold Believe Explum. Honestly, I'm probably gonna open my gold Believe Explum if I only end up with one because um, 
ultimately my joy in dolls the thing that i love the most about them is playing with them not playing with them but having them out of the box taking pictures of them holding them in my hands maybe playing with them a little bit don't tell anybody <laughs> um and i just don't get that when they're in the box although i do love dolls in box as well i think they're beautiful i love the historical aspect of it i also really 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 enjoy having them out of the box like this so it's really crazy to have them both in my hands like this right now all right so that is going to be it for this video gosh she's in so much better condition obviously but like this one's been through some stuff because i i legitimately took this doll to belize with me <laughs> i took uh, like 15 dolls to belize with me but she was one of them um so yeah that's it for this video thank you guys so so much for watching and again this was the question earlier but i need to ask it again because i'm really bad at ending videos which one is your favorite silver's mine still but don't let me sway you let me know um i almost do wish silver had some like color i like monotone dolls a lot but i like how believe power had two different shades of red oh we can include believe power because she kind of fits this she does she's just not limited edition at, or so we think <laughs> I'm just gonna have like a army of monotone Believix blooms. All right, I think my favorites. Hmm. I think blue beats red for me. I really like red. It's like one of my favorite colors, but I really like bloom in blue. I think she looks really good in it, which is why it's kind of the color that she always has on. Um. So yeah, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching for real this time. Oh, if you'd like to see like a comparison of these guys, because they all, in essence, have the same outfit. There's a few differences on um, red Believix Bloom, but, um, I think it would be interesting to compare them. This is one of those things where I suggest a video and you guys are like, yes, please show it to us, and then I don't make it for two years. <laughs> Thank you guys so, so much for watching for all this time. Bye!